This video covers the basic options of the Ultimate Product Catalog plugin, describing what each option does and showing a before and after visual where appropriate. The currency symbol option lets you display a currency indicator, such as a dollar or euro sign, with your product prices in your catalog. Either before or after the prices depending on what the currency symbol location option is set to. The sale mode option lets you decide whether sale prices should be displayed, if they exist for your individual products. They can either be set to all be displayed, be toggled on a product by product basis, or not be shown depending on the option you select. The thumbnail support option lets you display a smaller version of your images in your catalog, if enabled, which can help to speed up page load times for larger catalogs. The maintain filtering option determines whether filtering selections such as categories, custom fields, and the price slider should be set to those same selections when the visitor presses the back button in their browser after viewing a product. The social media options allow you to enable quick sharing links for your individual products on different social media platforms. The Set Access Role option lets you decide who should have access to the settings area for the product catalog. The Catalog Color option sets a number of borders and toggle images to the selected color, either blue, black, or gray. The Disable Auto Adjust Thumbnail Heights option stops the size of each product listing from being automatically adjusted in the thumbnail layout. The Auto Adjust is active by default, as it prevents having rows with odd numbers of products. Disabling it here will allow each product to be as tall as its content, but could make for uneven rows. The Subcategory Style option allows you to decide whether subcategories should be displayed as a group or below their respective top-level categories in the sidebar. The Read More option lets you add a Read More link to the description of products in the Details layout. If the description is longer than the number of characters set in the Characters in Details Description option below it. The Show Catalog Information option lets you display information about your catalog, either the name, description, or both. This shows above the catalog. The Show Category Descriptions option lets you display the descriptions you set for your product categories at the start of each category, when categories are added directly to the catalog. The Display Category Image option lets you display an image that you selected for that category, either above the category in the main catalog area or in the sidebar. The Display Subcategory Image option lets you display an image that you've selected for that subcategory in the sidebar. The Display Categories and Thumbnails option lets you display the categories and subcategories that are associated with the product in the thumbnail layout for that product. The Display Tags and Thumbnails option lets you display the tags that are associated with the product in the thumbnail layout for that product. The Product Links option lets you have external product links open in a new tab, so that visitors aren't forced to leave your website to view the product details if you are linking to external products. The Tag Logic option lets you specify whether, when filtering using tags in the sidebar, either all of the tags must match or just a single tag needs to match for a product to be displayed. The Disable Price Filtering option lets you remove the price filtering options in the sidebar. The Disable Slider Filter Text Inputs option disables the text inputs for price filtering. This removes the boxes around them and allows them to only be adjusted via the slider. The Catalog Overview Mode option lets your visitors start with an overview of the product categories you have available, and then select which category or subcategory of products to view, depending on the option you have selected. The Product Search option lets you specify which product elements should be searched when someone types in the text search box. Depending on your website server and the number of custom fields you have, searching them can increase search results time. The Clear All option adds a button at the top of the catalog sidebar, so that all filtering options can be cleared at once instead of needing to be cleared individually. The Hide Empty Filtering Options setting lets you hide filtering options that wouldn't return any products if, for example, a visitor types in the text search box and certain categories don't have any products that match the selected text. The Breadcrumbs option lets you specify which levels of product details, if any, should be displayed on the product page. Breadcrumbs let your visitors return to a specific filtering level more quickly. The Extra Elements option lets you decide which elements add value to the visitor's experience and should be displayed on the product details page. The Disable Product Page Price option lets you hide product prices on the individual product pages, 